Hey everyone, welcome back to Skyrim Modded. Oh, free that. So, guys, I just went around and I got some food and had a good night's sleep. Sold some stuff, sold the mammoth tusks and things I got there. So we got some gold. Got 3,400 now. Um, still want to go, we we'll still have to deliver that sword. Balgrove's great sword. So we're going to do that now and we've still got two mammoth tusks to sell. So hopefully we can find someone to sell that to as well. So. Let's go. Listen, Braith, why don't you talk to your mother about this, okay? There's a good girl. Oh. Uh... What are you looking at? I'm not afraid of you, you know, even if you are my elder. Oh, I want to kick you. If you were a little older, or I was your parent, I would give you such a beating. Oh my god, I love hey, you. Get out of here. Ah, uh -huh, she answered her back. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, wow. I, oh. That's fantastic. It certainly has turned out to be a rather miserable afternoon. Well... Wow. Not very nice. Quite rude, actually. Guess she wants to go and fight. I kind of do as well. I feel like we've spent way too much time in white room. I'm so angry, I can hardly stand it. Oh. Father promised me a new dress days ago. Now where is it? It takes a while to make a dress, Dagny. You have to be patient. But I don't want to be patient. I want a dress right now. Father promised. All you ever do is complain about what you want. You're a spoiled baby. I'm going to tell Father you said that. He'll tan your hive for sure. Wow. Kids are brat. Baldwin, did you slip out again last night for a drink of the Bannock Mare? Heard about that, did you? Mm. Yes, I went out for a pint or two. What of it? These secret visits to the tavern will make you an easy target for an enemy assassin. You should have told me first. Damn it, woman, I'm the Jarl of Whiterun. I won't apologize for talking to my people. Can't protect me every moment of the day. I like him. That might be so, but it will never stop me from trying. Ah. I think she has a thing for him secretly. Don't tell no one. Okay, we need. Wait, hold on. Let's just mark it, shall we? Not that one. Uh, that one. Where is he? Oh! No, that's a idea. Sorry. So sorry. <laughs> Sophia. <laughs> okay. There he is. Why are you doing all the way out here? There's a table I inside. Jarl Balgro as steward. Yes, I know. The Jarl is, as you can imagine, very busy. Perhaps I can assist you. Yes, um, I have a sword for you from your daughter. From Adrian? Ah, this must be that weapon for the Jarl. Poor girl. So eager to prove herself. I'll present it to Balgruff when his mood is agreeable. Awesome. Thank you. Please, take these few coins for services rendered. Well, it's an easy 20 gold, I guess. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. Thanks. Um, okay, so now... I think we, mm, we need to talk to Mikael. Oh, we didn't talk to Fendal either. Oh crap. I forgot to do that. Should go and do that. Um. Yeah, so we'll do these two things. We will go and t talk to Mikael about Carlotta and then we'll talk to Fendal. On our way to the graveyard. Okay. 
I need to dis to disenchant these things first though. I almost forgot about that again. Okay, so not the actual white one. This and this. There we go. And got some stuff to sell to him. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the on goat. Take Just a want look. to sell some shit to you, dude. That's all. Like that, for instance. And... I think that's it. Yeah. Now, what can you sell me? Mm. Each blocked melee hit restores 10. Ooh. Nah. I'm not, I'm not, nope. I'm not gonna do it. Even though I'm still looking. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's just leave it at that. You Tell know, me. if you've got. Yes, if I've got the ap aptitude, I should head to College of Winterhold. I get it. Um, so yeah, I made a load of food, got some beef stew and cooked beef, stuff like that. So we should be okay for a while. The aptitude. You should join the Mages College in Winterhold. Yes, I know. Oh, that's another thing. I was actually told that I... Where is it? In... Realistic Needs. That... Oh, it's food spoilage. That I should activate this. So I think I'm going to do that and... Yeah. I think I'll do that. So that the spood... The spood? <laughs> <laughs> the food spoils in a few days, basically. Um, let's see. Milk, three days. Mm, yeah, I suppose. Raw meat and fish is two days. So basically I have to cook everything. Cooked meat and fish is three days. Soups and stews. Oh, two days? Frick, I'll just leave it where it is. There we go. So let's try that as well now. Just add a bit more to the game, I guess. So, me cat. <laughs> Do I have any diseases? No, I don't. Just the armor thing. You're the best. Can you be my mother? Uh, boy. Hopefully he's in here. Or is that him there? What is him? I'm a bard by trade. Perhaps you've heard of me. Not really, but you need to leave Carlotta alone. Carlotta put you up to this, didn't she? I'm sorry, but that fiery widow is mine. Dude, she just doesn't know you. You're such a creep. She's not yours. Stop it. What did you just say? All I heard was a sound of jealousy. Okay, leave her alone. I don't have to take that from you. Come on. See what you're made of. Oh, this isn't gonna go well. Then. Oh, Sophia. Is that all you got? No. Why, why am I not losing health? Does he just hit? Me? Oh no, there we go. Oh damn it! Oh, maybe something. It's better than you. I can take you. Yeah, of course you can. Oh my God. So much blood. Oh boy. There we go. Pussy. Up. You know how to throw a punch, I'll give you that. Leave Carlotta alone, or this gets worse. You win. On my honor, Carlotta won't have to worry about me ever again. Good. Idiot. And you. Oh, God. Hi. 
Ripe fruit and fresh vegetables for sale. Yeah, I know. Um, Mikael won't be bothering me. Really? Yep. You convinced that loot player to stop chasing me? Did you not see? I'd thank the gods, but I'll settle for thanking you. Here's some coin for your help. Oh, thank you. Remember, fresh fruit and vegetables every day. <laughs> Mostly. Okay, so, now that we've done all that, we can go talk to Fendal. And... Yeah, I think we should get a horse as well. Because I don't fancy walking all the way to... the, the Greybeards. <laughs> Go buy a horse, shall we? Yeah. Um. Whoa. How old are your horses? None of them's older than nine, and the youngest is six. Now the horse I got for sale is seven years old, but in fine health. She's got a lot of spirit, that one. We've taken to calling her Queen Alfsiger, or just Ali for short. I expect you can name her anything you like, once she's yours. Awesome. Um, can Suppose I buy her? so. Got one all saddled, if you've got the coin. Mm. You've got a deal. It's the one with the saddle. Thanks. Right strong. Cool. Oh. Okay, I'll just let convenient horses update. Oh, look at her with her new horse. Nice. Okay, guys, that's convenient horses all updated, so now we can head to Riverwood again. I think I'm reading this book. So much better with a horse. <laughs> and so nice that my follower actually gets a horse as well. I think she already came with a horse anyway, but it's nice that she gets one too. Oh, Darcy. Probably hungry too, am I? Package thirsty. Okay, so guess mm, I'm only packaged though, so I love that. I'm no longer thirsty, but I could have a bit more food. Nine pork, nice. I wonder if we'll get into any fights on the way here. I don't know. Seems quite calm right now. If not, I'll just skip forward till we get to Riverwood. Don't think I don't see you eyeing me up and down. What? I'm not just eye candy, you know. I do have other uses. And if you're thinking what I think you are thinking, then think again. What? Oh my I god. Do like to be in my Who's that? I'm not going to even Should have got off and killed that deer, but I'll let it live for now. Oh, birds. Um. Somebody lose a horse? Hello? Um. Okay. <laughs> Random. Okay. 
Okay, we need to find Fandal. Oh, there he is! Ooh! Gotta have that fast jump. Are you gonna get off your horse, Sophia? Yes. Did you want something? Um. I could only hammer so fast. Oh. They don't have to be perfect. Just send them over. Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, that's what was wrong. Okay. Um. All okay. right then. You gonna get off your horse now? No, don't fall. God, why is she following me on my on her horse? Main horse pack follows with their own horse. Okay. Combat escape. Followers will break for no. Purchase mine. If any will followers will not dismount until player leaves. Let's see, might just come back. Why are you staying on your horse? Oh, there we go. Frickin' hell, by time. Now, where'd Fandal go? I lost him. Oh, don't go in your house. Come here. Tell me as soon as you've given Camilla the letter. I did. Um, she won't be spending any more time with Sven. I appreciate your help. Please take this. Some gold I've saved up from working at the mill. Thank you. Um. Cheers. Mm -hmm. So, horse following. I guess so. Uh, that's weird. We should probably chop some wood. Because we're going up into the mountains and I do not want to get caught without a fire if we're gonna freaking freeze to death or something, so. Let's get to chopping. Why did the Riverwood chicken cross the road? So, if it accidentally got hit. The carriage driver would get a five gold bounty, and the town would form an angry mob, chase down the carriage driver, and proceed to killing him anyway. <laughs> Seriously, though, the people of Skyrim are a bit touchy about their livestock. <laughs> oh, so true. Um, hi. What you doing? Okay. My horse is following me. It's so cute. Okay. <laughs> Stay there. Oh look, I told the horse will wait. Oh, that's so cool. Okay. I need what do I need for torches, because we need. Wow. We need torches badly, so I need linen wraps. Where can I get linen wraps? Do you have something to say? Not unless you have linen wraps, no. You and me, we're... Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. You don't have linen wraps. You suck. Do you have... Mm. What do you have? I need to make a fur tent. That's what I'd like to know as well. Small for a tent, but I Yes? Did you want something? Two leather and six clean pelts. Right. So. Are you 
sure you want to trust me with that? Actually, I'm taking off you, so yes, I do trust. Okay. That. And that. And that. I rather enjoyed a little chat. Good. So, right. Now I can make a small part for it in the bedroom. I'm nice. sorry, but I refuse to believe that anyone would be fighting over that Camilla what's her name in the Riverwood Trader. You would have to be deaf, dumb, and blind. You're a serious danger to the public to fancy her. Wow, really? Wow. There's only one bedroll in that though. Ugh. So you're gonna basically have nowhere to sleep. I need to give you like a bed or something, right? A bedroll. Mm. You've only got one deer hide. Ah, oh, god damn it! Fuck it. Doesn't matter. Come here. Yes, I'm listening. Actually, I'll just put them on my horse. Hey, okay. So put two of them on there, and the firewood can go there too. The mammoth tusks and the pelts. Also that, because I'm not going to be using that. Cloak I'll keep. I guess I'll keep all of them. Yeah, basically, that, yeah. I'm glad that's that's sorting. Okay, so. Let's go sleep. And then. We'll wake up and head up the mountain. Be careful. Oh, shut up, Rodnar. At least you don't have to pay for a room. <laughs> Damn faithless Imperials. Yeah. Damn them. Okay, so what? Just have eleven or sleep we can get up early. Go. Nice. Okay. Let's go. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. And yours. Whoa. Flying dog. So what way are we doing this? Oh, didn't want to do that. So if we go up this path, and then this way, we could actually get the the nettle bean as well on our way to it. Yeah? Sound like a plan? I think it sounds like a plan. Yeah. Okay. Where's our horse? Uh, pony? It's supposed to come. Can I do that? Oh, that is so cool. Okay, it's just down there. Never mind. Anyway. <laughs> um, what about your horse? What about that one? You know what? I'm not... not even... whatever. Thing. It was abandoned for no reason. It was a nice looking horse as well. 